First of all, Minister, can I congratulate you also on your new appointment? I do look forward uh, to working with you, and I would suggest that you don't mind Deputy Flaherty up in Longford looking for a windfall. Look at your neighbours first in Sligo and uh, Roscommon and Leitrim, etc. But I want to raise the issue that you yourself have raised before now, and that is the need for stage payments for the Cree Coney grants. I know you support this because, as you've said yourself, it's similar to what is the standard practice um, as it is now when people are building homes. But I would also ask you, Minister, uh, and I would be, I don't expect you to deal with that immediately, but I would like to know that you support it. But there's two other issues. I think we may need more staff in local authorities to deal with the applications for Creconia. So I'm looking for support for the local authorities. And also, is there any possibility in exceptional circumstances if there could be an extension in the timeline for completion? Asking Corlin, thanks to all the deputies for their contributions. Um, just in relation to the stage payments uh, question, uh, that currently, is currently under review uh, and considerations are being taken in that regard. In relation to the, um, the, the scheme itself, um, significant work has been done at a local authorities level in terms of uh, additional resources and we would hope to be in a position to make a further, make a further announcement in that regard. We have seen town regeneration officers now being integrated into local authorities. We have seen vacant, uh, vacancy home officers in each of the 31 local authorities. I think that has been a significant step forward, but we're always conscious that local authorities uh, need additional resources. And I know Minister O'Brien is working uh, diligently within the department and with uh, public expenditure and reform to seek funding in that regard. But certainly um, this scheme is really, really important. We want to ensure that there is no delays in relation to uh, the approval process to the actual completion of these works. It's really, really important that, that we can continue through this measure to increase housing supply all across the country and make it as easy and as accessible for everyone.